Hey guys, it's my Vida Loca. I'm just here at the hospital. Um, I was at work and I was just feeling a bunch of sharp back pain and it went down my leg. Um, I've been feeling that since I started working. It's only been like three days. Um, but I usually have back pain, but not to this extent. Um, it hurt really bad to where I had to come to the emergency room. Um, that's where I am right now. We're just waiting for blood work and test results to come back to see what's going on. Um, we couldn't um, pinpoint the baby's heart because she keeps moving too much. Um, so they're just checking to see if I'm having contractions of any sort. Um, also, yeah, we're just waiting for results to come back in. So yeah. Hey guys, so they just came and checked my cervix and it's still closed and I'm still waiting forever in the ER. It's the only thing I hate about it. It takes like five hours being here. Um, she had to come check my cervix and it's still closed, but nothing about the results yet. Um, so I'll keep in touch. Hey guys, so I guess it was just an infection. It's common with pregnancy. Um, so they just gave me an antibiotic to take for a week. Um, that does, that is what's causing the pain in my lower stomach. Um, and also the cerratic pain they can't really do anything about that they just recommend like hot and cold pads and um massaging it in a belly brace i think it's called so i gotta look on amazon or at walmart and see if they if i can find one because i feel like i do need that too because i feel like it hangs really low my stomach and i feel like i have to support it all the time and that can be causing my back pain to flare out because of all the baby Okay, so pretty much that's what happened. I just had to do a follow-up with my doctor. Um, I'm glad nothing else was, nothing else happened, and that was it. Because I was scared I was going to go into preterm labor because it felt like that because of the pain. Because you know how when you have contractions, it's lower back pain, down your leg, contractions underneath your stomach. So I had to got all of those. So I just felt like I was going into it. So yeah, I'm just going to go stop by CVS um, and get the prescription. Um, and now the hospital, I guess they check you every time you go in. Um, they'll ask you questions and take your temperature. And give you a sticker. Sorry. I really hate emergency rooms. It's been like, it's like every hospital I go to, the emergency room takes like six hours to be seen. Anyways, guys, that was kind of scary, but wasn't too bad. Nothing. They didn't get to see baby, but I felt her the whole time, but they just couldn't get a heartbeat on her because she wouldn't stay still. Um, but yeah, guys, I'm just going to head to CVS, pick up my prescription, and then head home. Um, and yeah, guys. And if you're not subscribed, please subscribe and hit that, bol that bell notification to get notified every time I post a new video. And thank you for watching. If you have any qu questions, leave them in the comments. And I'll be happy to answer them. Thank you.